We got the controversial new song, Minimum Wage, from Blake Shelton. It's a pretty, uh, pretty cool song and a pretty easy one to play. We're going to learn it today. Stick around. Alright, so this is a standard tune guitar. We're going to capo up to the 4th fret on this one. I like to keep that capo up nice close, nice and close to that fret. Eliminates bending strings out of tune and fret buzz and things like that. I'm going to show you two different ways to play it. I'm going to show you this way because I feel like this is probably the easier way to play it. But I mean you can decide for yourself. So. You're going to start on G. You're going to use G, F, and C shapes out of this uh, with this version here. So it sounds like this. give you a version two here um, if you're somebody who doesn't have a capo maybe um, you just pull that capo off and I will show you the chord progression you're gonna use uh, with no capo you're gonna use B A and E and the reason I felt the other way was a little easier to play is because actually with it open B is pretty much your main note in there and probably for a lot of beginner guitar players that's probably a little bit of a struggle with that chord to run that back and forth and as the main chord in the song just a theory i could be totally wrong you could be great at it i could be just blowing smoke and full of it so this version sounds like this you're going to start on b so it's going to go b a e and it sounds like this <laughs> There it is, a couple of different ways to play that one. Wanted to give you a couple of options just so you can have some fun with it. But basically it just goes on a loop with those three chords. So either three that you choose, you're good to go. Yeah, in the intro there, I talked about this being a controversial song. I heard an interview with him the other day and he was talking about there's some type of controversy. People were offended that that are on minimum wage or so I don't I don't understand. I mean, if you listen to the lyrics in the song, you can understand what he's talking about and the metaphor that he's making there. So, if you're really going out of your way to try to make something controversial about a song like this, I think you're digging a little too deep into it. Until the next time, I'll catch you down the road. Everybody wants